Here's a totally trash golden rule for you. If you want a loyal, obedient buddy that will adore you with its whole heart and light up when you see it, buy a dog. If you want a fluffy companion that will ignore you at every opportunity and bring you dead mice you never asked for because it thinks you're too incompetent to hunt, get a cat. All seems pretty simple, right? Well, actually, things aren't always so black and white. Despite being one of the world's oldest dog breeds, for example, the Basenji famously behaves like a cat. Similarly, some cats behave a lot like dogs. But which breed comes closest to being man's best friend? Often labeled the dogs of the cat world, Maine Coon cats are large, gentle, and play well with others, including children and other people's pets. Unlike other kinds of felines, these cats love water, too, and they really love to please people. Proud Maine Coon owner Ashley Osterman told How Stuff Works, My cat Maddie lays next to me all of the time and even follows me from room to room in my apartment. Maine Coons can even enjoy playing fetch, and some have been taught how to walk on a leash. Although, it's worth noting that the RSPCA has warned against putting cats on leashes, explaining that even a cool cat like the Maine Coon could easily lose control, and that treating your cat like a dog in that regard may do more harm than good. But what about the Manx? From the sound of things, Manx cats are constantly experiencing the world's most adorable identity crisis, since humans have likened the Manx to both a dog and a rabbit. Their name comes from their native Isle of Man, where they appeared near the beginning of the 18th century. To this day, the Manx still appears on the reverse of some of the Isle of Man's coins. According to legend, the famously tailless Manx is the fluffy love child of a rabbit and a cat. In reality, a genetic mutation led to the cute stub for which they're famous, with that particular mutation resulting from years of inbreeding. Moreover, not all Manx cats are tailless, and some even have normal-length tails, giving rise to the nickname Longies. Like the Maine Coon, the Manx likes water. It also likes to ride in cars, follow people around, play fetch, and play watchdog. Protecting loved ones isn't a game to the Manx, though, and it will take guarding its human family very seriously. Unfortunately, they're not exactly the most intimidating animals either. Still, what they lack in brawn, they make up for in brains. Manx cats are incredibly clever and are even able to turn on faucets and open doors. They're also known to be quite talkative and will hold a conversation with you in a quiet trill. And then there's the savanna. Unlike the Maine Coon and the Manx, the savanna cat is actually dog-like by design, and the breed is only actually a few decades old. Loyalty is their hallmark trait, with some owners reporting that their savannas have actually showered with them. A mix of the more feral, serval, and domesticated cats, savannas maintain some of their wild instincts, and many owners end up coming down with a raging case of buyer's remorse. What is up with that cat? Is someone throwing it? And although savannas interact well with children and dogs when properly socialized, Susan Bass of the Florida's Big Cat Rescue Sanctuary told the Dodo that she's had to perform some big human rescues. She explains, We get calls all the time from people asking us, begging us to take them off their hands. Savannas are also notorious for howling at night and can pose a danger to children and the elderly. If that wasn't bad enough, they have acidic, foul-smelling urine that has a tendency to be sprayed over pretty much everything. In fact, according to Bass, savannas are pretty much the opposite of dogs. But they're not really much like cats, either. Think of them more as howling, spraying shower monsters, and you're probably a little closer to reality. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more grunge videos about your favorite animals are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.